Welcome back. We're talking about tints now. Tint is a color that is mixed with white. And it refers to any lighter or darker variation of a color. So if I tint it a little bit, I have a dark tint. And if I tint it a lot, I have a light tint. That's what that means. So it's whenever you add white to a color to change that effect. So let's watch the video on tints to explain it a little more. Here are some simple examples. When you add white, you get an effect like Monet in the top, where you're adding white. And at the bottom, where you're adding white to your painting and your paint and your colors. And this is the result you get. You get tints. Tints is when you add white to your color. And I'm repeating this a lot so that it stays in your mind. I found that I heard it quickly when I was first started learning and it never really stuck. So I'm repeating it a lot so that it sticks for you. And on the right, we have J.M.W. Turner who added shades to his painting. He created variations on the darks and added black to his color. In his sky area, he added white, so he tinted the sky area. And in the water and the dark areas, he added shades to his color. So these are wonderful examples of uh, what you can do. As far as completely abstract work, I couldn't find anything that would match, that would explain it well enough for you to remember it properly. So let's watch the video on tints to explain it a little more. Tints by Doris Charest. So tints are means adding white. So we're going to take our primary colors and we're going to add white to them so that you can see what it looks like. I'm starting with yellow. I add a white and then I put it next to my yellow. As you can see, it's instantly brighter. So adding white lightens it. Often it makes it look a little bit brighter. Now wash your brush and we'll do a second color. We're going to add white to the red. You probably know what's going to happen now. You create a tint of pink and it's a tint of red. And there you go. You have a tint. This is what a red tint looks like. Now, if I was to add a little less white and it would be a little darker, it would be a dark tint. This is a light tint. I'm washing my brush and I'm going to start again with the blue. And I'm adding some blue here and I'm creating a tint. So this is a very light tint. And if I was to add more blue, it would still be a tint. It would be a darker tint. Now I'm going to create some sketches. I've speeded up the camera just so that it's not so boring for you. And I fill in the spaces. So I want to create something that is using only tints. And these tints I'm going to mix and add right here. I'm starting with blue. Remember to wash your brush in between each color and so that you have a more pure color. And I'm going to add pink next to, well, the tint, red tint, I should say. I shouldn't say pink. I should say a red tint next and add it to the top and create a certain look. Now, don't be afraid to make these sketches and see what it would look like if you use these tints. Before you start a painting, you should always create a little sample like this. So I have a blue tint at the bottom, a re red tint at the top, and a yellow tint as an accent. Now I'm going to do it again, a second sketch. I'm going to use the color yellow that will be the, the basic strong color. 
on the left one it was the red tint that was the strong color the dominant color here it's going to be the yellow that's the dominant color and now i'm going to add a blue tint to the top and create a different look already you can see how different that looks by choosing which color is going to be the dominant color so when you do your sketches think carefully about what colors will be dominant here i'm only doing two samples but you can do as many as you like until you're happy with the composition and happy with the look that's there here i have a red tint accent and you can see what the difference is which one do you prefer so now it's your turn what you need to do now is create your own sketch using only shades and tints or neutral colors shades and tints are neutral colors that you add to a painting try creating a painting with only shades and tints see what it does for you don't be afraid to do more than one sketch do this now and we'll see you in the next section bye for now